Okay, one of the interesting things that I've seen on this video is that um, you know there are images of boats and cars and homes, luxurious homes, and how you know a snapshot. I mean, if uh, a, a video of how this guy you know pushes to his daughter, you know, all those beautiful images that one may want to pursue. And you know, as a matter of fact, that that this is definitely what one looks for. However, um, there's one thing I need to mention. Um, I would like to set up some variables. Um, so you know, the mentors tell her that you know it's not it's not uh, it's not a um, scam because of the fact that it takes years, if not many years, to achieve the success that some of the people that some people theoretically get to. Um, but if you think about other ways to get rich, let's say uh, through real estate market, let's say let's say you know let's say flipping the the homes. First of all, in order to flip a house, you gotta have money. Second of all, you have to have experience. Second of all, you have to take risks. Um, and you have to take a lot of time. It takes a lot and a lot of time. Now here in Quickstar, all you gotta do is pay two hundred dollars or whatever it is now. A year it was two hundred, and you earn the deal. All you have to have two hundred dollars, which is virtually is not an investment. Uh, and all you gotta do is just work hard and recruit people. Now, now compare this to somewhat realistic, but maybe to some it's not. Compare this to real estate investor who has to spend. First of all, he has to have money. Second of all, he has to be experienced. Third of all, he has to have a um, he has to spend a lot of time on this. And fourth of all, he has to invest risk, which means that you know he can lose all that money. Now compare these four things to Quickstar, which only requires you to invest time, virtual two hundred dollars, nothing. So just compare these two and just think about it. Which one is really, really true? investment opportunities and things that can make you just think about it just compare two things um think i mean it's called business i like the way we say business i don't know if it's a business whatever it doesn't matter but just just think about or, or let's say stock market let's say stock market i mean many people get rich in stock market in stock market first of all you gotta have money you gotta have money if you don't have money you have nothing second of all you have to be experienced because if you're experienced you're gonna lose money theoretically third of all you have to take risk now these three things you do not do in Quick start or or the company. So just comparing these two things, how much investment does a real opportunity takes, like stock market, real, real estate investing, etc., and how much um, Quick Start you know re like requires. Or think about a entrepreneurship. Entrepreneurship first of all requires huge social skills. You have to be very very socially active. Socially active. You have to have a lot of contacts, great amount of contacts. You have to have an idea. I mean, you can buy the idea, but still, you got, you, you have to promote it. And you have to go through this. It takes a lot of time. Now, you don't, you don't need this in stock market. All you are promised is a simple, you know, rich life. You know, all those boats, all that imagery that they post. And you, you do not need risk. You do not risk anything. You barely invest anything. And you are. Uh, what else? Okay. You don't. Okay. Yeah. Whatever. The point is that there's virtually nothing to, you know. I mean, I mean, just those things just, you know, tell the truth, you know, I mean, you can argue me, please do so. Okay, thanks for watching.